hey everyone welcome back on the channel again uh, i know i am late to the party but yeah it was in diwali in my location and uh, there was so much noise and music so i did not uh, made a video about this outer worlds 2 uh, the game is developed in unreal engine so it's another mess as you can see my fps is only around like 30 in this area i am right now playing on 1080p with uh, fsr 4 on quality the game does comes with fsr4 out of the box so you don't need to paste any other dll but yeah my mod will also contain the fsr4 uh, the rest of the setting i'm playing it on uh, medium uh, also the game does comes with uh, xss frame generation and dlss frame generation and my mod will be able to make both the frame generation uh, work like if you want to use the in-game xss frame generation that will be also available if you want to use the mod dlss frame generation that will also be available so yeah let's start this video without any delay now all right so here you can see two to three files uh, now first this is the main mod which uh, we will use after that uh, we will see engine file which is not needed for this mod but if you want to use the upscaler to xcfg then you will uh, need this file to paste it in, in a specific location which i will uh, show you on your screen but i won't go any deeper into that particular tutorial and after that you will see another zip which is no intro which is basically skips all the uh, startup intro of the game which is very good for uh, like testing purpose like if you want to start the game again and again and you have to face all the intros and everything uh, so yeah first i'm gonna extract the mod on the desktop then copy all the files inside the directory and gonna go to the games installation directory for me which is uh, here the auto worlds 2 after that arkansas then binaries then win64 and where the outer worlds to win64 shipping.ex is located i'm gonna paste the mod and replace the file which it asks for after that just set up the windows setup.bat and i will set up as dxgi so press 1 and then press enter after that select your gpu i have nvidia so i'm pressing 2 then press enter press any key to continue again go to same folder open the optiscalar.ini here it is with any kind of notepad or text editor and you will need to scroll down to around this area where you will see fg input and fg output so in this input type i will type dlssg but if you want to use upscaler as the fg input you will need to use this engine file which i showed earlier and in this output section we will use xcfg after that we click on file click on save now i'll simply dive back in the game and i'll show you how much fps we're getting and how we can set up the frame generation and everything get black myth wukong and resident evil 4 separate ways at just 149 rupees combo all right now i am in the loading screen but i want to tell you one thing that if you want to use that skip intro mod all you need to do is extract the zip to the games installation directory where we pasted the mod and uh, you will get a bat file in that zip uh, which uh, comes as no intro dot bat so yeah uh, run that bat file press enter two times and you will be good to go all right so i'm back inside the game uh, let me bring the opti to a little bit more bigger so you guys can see more clearly there we go all right so first things first we will need to head to setting then graphics and in here we will set the upscaling to dlss and turn the frame generation on to dlss frame generation now one thing is when you paste my mod you will also be able to use the xss frame generation in game so if you are not able to use the dlss fg you can still use the in game xss fg with my mod so yeah it's a win-win situation but yeah i'm gonna set the dlss frame generation here after that just click on apply keep then go back to the game then press ins slash insert on the keyboard and click on this active button now it will show you to restart the game once but yeah if you don't restart it will also work fine and as you can see fps has now boosted uh, from 30 to around 69 nice uh, 69 70 range and if i yeah uh, if i change the upscaler preset to 
preset F with DLSS4 it will maybe boost maybe one or two FPS more yeah there we go like and around 70 to 72 uh, so yeah this will be it for this video now if this uh, helps you mm, consider liking the video for algorithm and if you are facing issue comment down below and i'll see you guys in the next one join my discord for cheap games and everything so see you guys later